Warsaw Council's enforcement officers on operation in an alleyway off Stafford Street, they've discovered a collection of waste. This team are working as part of an intensified campaign against fly tipping by Warsaw Council. It's not just about dealing with the piles of abandoned bin liners. Proactive measures can save the authority considerable time and money. Part of this scheme is about preventing fly tipping, which is why officers have been talking to residents and landlords to check if they have suitable ways to safely and legally dispose of their waste, if they've got the correct bins, or if not, information as to how they can get hold of them. As for this fridge freezer, well, depending on if this turns out to be council land or not, this could be likely to be fly tipping. The team continue their search and find this. It's been absolutely awful, the, the poverty that people live in um, and the fact they haven't got the right bins, the right size bins. It's a danger to public health and to public finances. Government figures reveal that councils across the Midlands region recorded a combined total of 75,000 fly tipping incidents in the 12 months to last April. The cost of the clean-up is huge. We spend nearly a million pounds a year cleaning up fly tipping, which could be used for social workers, which we're screaming out for mental health, nurses, etc. And I don't think people understand the extent. And we're getting tougher. We are out there putting CCTV up to catch these people who are committing these crimes. Earlier this month, 40-year-old Robert Andruskevich pleaded guilty to fly tipping after being caught on camera dumping this fridge. A sentence of a fine and community service compounds the message on the pavement, a plea to keep the borough clean. Emma Thomas, BBC Midlands Today, Warsaw.